Now let's talk about the data types that we have in Apex. So data types are very, very important when it comes to Apex because it is a strongly typed language, which means that every variable needs to be declared with a data type. We cannot have a same uh, data type for every type of variable. Now let me explain you what exactly data type is. So imagine you want to store rice, then you will have a specific type of container. If you want to store water, then you'll have a specific type of container. If you want to store sugar, then you'll have a specific type of container. So it's exactly the same. Variables are basically used to store some data or some type of information. And those variables needs to be of particular type. Like if you want to store numeric value, then that needs to be integer type. And if you want to store uh, like a date uh, into a variable, then in that case, it needs to be of date data type. So that's exactly what it is and how it works. So every variable in Apex needs to be declared with a particular data type. And it is very, very important for us to understand the different data types that we are available with in Apex. So we have primitive data types, collections, S objects, uh, user defined data types, and many more. So first we're gonna understand the primitive data types that we have in Apex.